did not know. She let me play with her heart. <gasps> Text message. <laughs> no more. Now that I'm stuck with you, ain't that upper body chest shoulders forearms um biceps triceps back the whole thing today um i was gone from the gym for two weeks or a week and a half um i messed up my back pretty bad i had to take prescription medicine and now i'm gonna go to the doctors tomorrow to see what is going on with me i just live like Five minutes away from the gym. Um, I don't go to a fancy gym. I honestly feel like there's no, I'm not gonna pay $45 just for a squat rack when there's a Smith machine there. Um, it does get crowded because it is a small, super small gym. Um, but I have the VIP pass, I don't know. I get to go to any gym I want to. It's the only, like the only, Thing I use from the VIP other than that I do not I don't really use it for anything else I mean there's tanning and the massage chair but I'd rather not mm, I don't like parking here I like to be a douchebag sometimes so I'll show you guys how I'm a douchebag this is like how I like to be a douchebag so that's my gym Right there. Freedom Fitness. Nothing too fancy, but again, it's not a bad gym either. But I'm gonna answer a few questions. Let me just get comfy. Okay. So my first question is, if you hadn't had, if you hadn't have started working out, where would you think you would be? Um, before, before I wasn't working out, I was, a, I was like a really miserable person. Meaning as, if I was sad and if I was mad, and pe the people that I was with, or if I saw people that were happy, I would take them down with me because I didn't want to be the only one going through things. And I didn't know how to handle it, so I guess that's how I thought I could handle it, by thinking of giving my despair to others would help me out but really did it that's like one of the most horrible things you could do to somebody once i started working out i felt so much better i quit <laughs> in other words i quit being a bitch i mean yes i do have my moments where i do clap back but it's only when people disrespect me or think they can so honestly I wouldn't be anywhere I would I would have my ambitions my motivation wouldn't wouldn't have brought me where I am today like I'm 20 I'm starting I'm barely starting my own business like but I'm barely starting my own business and there's so many things that I want to do so if without working out I would be a nobody literally a nobody I would be that somebody that nobody wants to be with um would you be willing to train people yes that's one of my many dreams into doing but I just really want to get some knowledge first of all more knowledge and be certified in a lot more things before I have the ability to train somebody because I don't want to train somebody only because I have a because uh, I'm certified I'm a certified personal trainer that's not good enough for me I would want to be like oh she's like a certified nutritionist or or whatever if that's possible I think that's possible to be certified in yeah I think so so 
right now no but i am and i will um another question is have you used protein or mass gainer if so did they help yes i have i used um my ex-boyfriend bought me the three bags of the dynamite i believe it was it was two of chocolate mint and one of vanilla they were really really good but since that was my first one of mass gainer wise it was so much on my body like i threw up um my first time i ever took it um that one didn't really help me out a lot of mass gainers don't help me out but for me i don't think that's necessary because i learned that you just really need food like a good meal plan in order to gain the weight that you want and then if you hit a plateau or if you want that extra push then yeah then taking a mass gainer is good for protein i'm well i was recently taking the I believe it was the isolate i don't know i'll put it in the in the description of what type of uh protein i take and stuff but they didn't really help out that much for me um I didn't see no difference probably because I wasn't eating right either and I was only taking the mass gainer. So you need to eat right also. So don't don't put all your confidence in, into just the proteins and mass gainers. That's not really going to help you out. Um, how did you get through the hard times? Oh. <laughs> um, going through the hard times, I... I learned how to do it. I had to learn how to do it at the hard time. At first, when I would... Um, when an obstacle would come to me, I would be punching the wall so hard. I would bust my knuckles. I don't even know how they're not, like, I didn't break them. But I would end up with, like, swollen knuckles. Like, hideous. And th my hands would end up bleeding, cut, purple. And I learned that's not the good, like, a good way. So then I decided, um, getting a therapist because I was going through a lot. And it's really hard for, to open up to somebody that you don't know but then again opening up to somebody you don't know they're not it's gonna sound mean but they're not really in a way concerned about your feelings they're gonna give you the 100% truth like they're a stranger to you and you're a stranger to them so they're gonna be like okay like this is what I see instead of a friend they're gonna sugarcoat stuff so that was another way I uh, dealt with uh, the hard like going through the hard things another way was a gym like the gym is my stress reliever if i don't go to the gym for let's say two days i am such an angry mean person it was also a great way isabel like she is like a sister to me i love her to death uh she's a, we did like cut off being friends for a while and you know how girls are girls talk shit about each other um girls would believe anything that they want to so we did talk shit about each other um but we matured we grew up because we both admitted our wrongs and now we're friends again more like sisters how do you react towards people's negativity towards you or anyone else let me show you this is how i deal with negativity um i learned not to at first i would respond to it and not the right way i would respond to it back with negativity but i learned that i could use my words pretty good so i started using my wise words instead of trying to hurt others because they're miserable with their lives and i'm only saying that because that's how i was but this how i deal with negativity is really was really difficult at first um i usually would just um as a lot of people don't want to like delete and block because they they feel like they're weak like that they're giving themselves a weak that they're a weak person as an image and giving themselves an image that they're weak but once you see like how many people you impact or how many people really truly love you and actually care for you you just don't give a fuck you just delete block delete block 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 sometimes i'm blocked because you want to be petty <laughs> i'm kidding no but I, I, yeah that's it's really hard at first but 
you know, you, 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 you can't, you can't, you can't get rid of it, no matter what. You just learn how to deal with it, and not like, oh, you keep it to yourself, but, you know, you can use your words, you could, everybody has their own way, but for me, I could, I use my words now, um, the gym is, the gym is my boyfriend, we are married, they just, the, I don't even know why I'm not even hired at a gym, I was hired at a gym, I was a shaker girl for, um, I mean, yeah, shake girl for, at Gold's Gym, I got fired, or I kind of quit, got fired. But I'll talk about that later. Um, what did you do to lean out? What did you do to gain weight? You know, you guys need to see what you are eating. That's like the main thing on how to gain weight and how to lean out. That's what beginners do to lose weight. What beginners could do to lose weight is learn what they need to eat. The first thing that you should do is eat right before doing anything. It's, that's the main thing, that's like 70% on your outcome, on your body, is what you eat. Other than that, yeah, you're good, you're good. But that's my, that's just like one of my beginner tips. Also, drink a lot of water. Water is life. Water is your boyfriend from now on, and your girlfriend if necessary.